not. Oh, I thought that... God, I thought that fucking pop-up informing you about the everyone thing might have been, like, fake. Lol. I'm a pop-up. If you try to do at here or every, at everyone when it will affect enough people now, then it will it will be like, Whoa, be careful, there's a lot of people. Oh. Um, That's Jesus Christ, how horrifying. Yeah. Um, I'm going to turn on my thing, and I'm also going to switch to high performance mode, just so I can... <laughs> Get some more bang for my buck. Huh, more like by performance. Do, 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 do. Um, you know, considering I couldn't do Mother 3 with screen share without it slowing, I doubt I'll be able to do this, so I'm not even going to try. Um, it really uh, matters much here because it's not yeah, like... it doesn't. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Okay. Um, so sort of fuck up that for a little bit. Is that back to looking normal? You're cutting out a lot. Really? Okay, let's try restarting the call quick. end the call what is he doing um can i be heard and, and stuff by the way i assume i can i need to um i want to show you guys the game history of my previous run before i start just as a little warm-up and to delay the actual gameplay could that say hurry up what is he waiting for one second dante yeah. What are you waiting for? <laughs> what do you mean, what am I waiting I said, for? I said, let's restart the call, and I even messaged you. You didn't... Okay, you didn't say that, and I was playing video games, so I didn't see your message, I, and it didn't... I did say that. Either. It's verifiable. I'm on stream. Maybe, maybe you said it, but it definitely didn't let me hear it. Okay, well, I did wait, like, a second after. Whatever. Um... Sound is working? Okay, good. Uh, and can you hear me fine, Dante? Yeah. All right. So I'm going to start off by showing the game history of my market is normalized, whatever. Yeah, you can see I'm on, I'm on year, th excuse me, year 36. I've got 388.8 million cash. Uh, i got all these options. Let's look at my game history from the previous run. So we want to go all the way to the start. Also, I can't actually see the chat. Uh, that should be okay. Probably. Anyway, I'm not going to comment on these because I don't have time, but... Just a little warm up while I wait for people to show up. Hmm. Nice. I'm not going to comment on any of these because I explained them a bunch of times to uh, other people. But I will say that I kind of tried to go for. I had a few, I had a few different franchises, but um, I was mainly like an RPGs on the play system line of consoles. Uh, Are you RPGs? I was RPGs. Yeah, I gave a mixture of stupid names and names that reference stuff from, like, ideas I've had in the past or as a kid or whatever. Or I just came up with stuff that made sense, like the Mute series. Mute is short for mutant because it's like a post-apocalyptic thing. I thought it worked. That was a typo, that one. Ba -na -na -na. I still say you should have a series called, like, Untitled Game. That was an accident. I know, but you should have just fucking ran with it. 
maybe. Oh, almost at the end here. Yeah, didn't do so well the last few, but I did okay. Anyway, we're gonna start a new game. You can't do that, that's illegal. <coughs> Welcome the Mad Woman, she's done it. In this business simulation, you've been transported back in time to start your very own game development company, right to the beginning of the PC revolution. In the next 35 years, you can build your dream company, create best-selling games, gain fans, and become the leader of the market. You know them well. <laughs> yep. So, if we start adventure... Oh, yeah, let's uh, let's think of a name for our company. I need to... Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll go ahead and make my myself here. Um, quite limited for options. I think I was this. But yeah, what uh, what company name should I go with, Dante? <coughs> um, Booty Pants Studio. No, I know exactly what it has to be. Ah, oh, Ojama Yellow's butthole doesn't fit. God damn it! Stop with the fucking Ojama Yellow. <laughs> <laughs> oh, John May Yellow Corp. Not EA is good, but no, I think I'm gonna go with the John May Yellow Corp. Like that. Um, yes, I would like to import the previously gained hints. I am using a guide for this just because that's how I like to play this game, but no. Nah. I'm anyway. sorry, what are you importing? The, uh, th this game re uh, semi recently added a feature where if you, um, make a game, you can gain insights on what went well and what went bad about it based on the game's, like, internal... Oh, wait, thing. recently? Really? Mm-hmm. Like, the start this here? Mm-hmm. Wow, that is really recent. So the topics are also random every time you restart the game, I believe. Yep. I never got fantasy in my previous one. So you know what? Let's make a fantasy game. Hmm... I believe fantasy goes well with a lot of things, actually. Action, adventure, RPG, or strategy. Should I make it an RPG and just make it an Unabondus game? I think that'd Odd. Be that'd be pretty start. incredible, actually. And... Let's see. RPGs are pretty good on the... PC, but what would be more optimal is an adventure. I think we want to start strong. That's yeah, PC it. really loves those adventure games. That said, Onomandos is technically more of an RPG. Oh, you can see it right here. I'm not, uh, maybe I'll make a vocabulary strategy game later, but uh, I'm gonna start with Onomandos. Yeah, it's it's an RPG. Let's 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 be let's be faithful to it. So this will be, excuse me. I'm just gonna call it Onomandos. It'll have 2D graphics, why not? Okay. Let's go. Mm hmm. Something like that. Let's go a bit more heavy on story quests. I don't really have enough money to do a marketing campaign, but once. Uh, once, once I am, the best place to do it is just after this development stage too. Let's see, dialogue, artificial intelligence, doesn't matter. Something like that. Wow! So yeah, here is where I'd do it. Do I even have the option? I don't even have the option, never mind. I think you have to research it first. Oh boy, look at that fucking 8-2... Fucking point ratio. Mm. Yep. In fact, there's no music in fucking non Mondos. <laughs> so that's the first thing. Something like that. Who's asking me? I oh, know, it's just a thing. Do I have any viewers other than Gerati and Dante? I'm also not explaining a lot of this just because <coughs> it would take a while. If anyone's confused about something, you can ask me, but I think it's pretty self explanatory. Let's finish. Sound does not exist. Oh, it didn't say new record. I guess it counts records from the other game. Was it the other one? That uh, makes sense. I don't know. Mm. 
Uhum. Vamos ser rasgados. Oh boy. Yeah, okay. Did well. Oh, that's a seven. Okay. And the last one is the most wild cardy one. Okay. Okay, not bad though. Seven point uh two five. <laughs> Fucking Ojama Yellow Corp, god damn it. Why did I name us that? You are really loud. Lag ears. Really loud on your ears? Dante? Oh wow, over 10k units. Um, yeah, let's start, let's generate a game report. Get some research points, so we can start doing some research. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. We almost doubled our cash, that's cool. Okay, let's research. New topic. <laughs> should I research colonization? I think I should research colonization. Yeah, yeah, Govador 64. Yeah, uh, that's, that's not gonna happen. Nice try 80s um, industry experts. Okay. Let's see. So a colonization. What does that go well with? Oh no, it didn't say here. Um, let me check here. Like I said, I'm using a guide, but I don't care. That's how I prefer to play. Probably. Let me check though. I think strategy could. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it's best for Sims and strategy. <clears throat> so, I think strategy is best for. Strategy is slightly better for PC. Let me check. I mean, they're both the same, it doesn't really matter. So, what should I go for? Simulation or strategy? Okay. PC. Mm. At the beginning, you're kind of limited in options because there's only PC in Govador 64 and the G64 sucks. But once uh, like NES and Genesis and stuff start coming out, then you start getting more options. I'm, I'm not sure what exactly I should make, but we'll, we'll decide when we get there, I guess. It's good to make a variety of stuff, but from my experience, you tend to end up like Filling a certain kind of role, like I was doing a lot of RPGs on PlayStation con or Play System consoles. Uh, not sure why I should call this one. <coughs> uh oh. Apparently, Dante can't hear me. I'm gonna figure out what is going on before proceeding.
Okay, it looks like my laptop is just kind of a fuck, so. Right, what should this game be called? It's going to be a colonization strategy game. Maybe just something dumb like call it like Christopher Colonizzi. It's <laughs> dumb. Um, Bivalization. Do that. People ask, "What does the B mean?" And I'm like, "It means whatever you want." <coughs> All right, let's see. Um, strategy, so we want gameplay at the top. Yep, this doesn't really matter. This should be pretty good. Japanese company Ninvento apparently are planning to launch a home gaming console after the successful arcade game in Dinky King. Many industry experts doubt that home gaming consoles will take off. We're eager to see what Ninvento will deliver. Okay, not bad. <coughs> okay. How was that? Hey! Okay, so it does keep records. It just doesn't show you the first time because it's redundant. That's fair. I was worried it was going to compare it to my previous thing. Because the... Seeing when you've broken a record is helpful. Okay, let's see how this goes. Uh-oh. That doesn't look too good. Oh! No, that's right. Cool. Nice. Mm hmm. Here's a wild card. I say wild card because they often, they off, I believe all games often goes higher or lower, like at random. Who else generate a game report? Okay. Let's develop a new game. Let's do this as a vocabulary. Um, yep. It's good for sim, strategy, and casual. Since we did um, vocabulary strategy, let's do vocabulary to simulator. I've got just the name for it. Excuse me. There we go. <laughs> mm, yeah, this is basically the same. Let me go a little harder on gameplay though. There's the TES. Mm. We want mm. 
and go for something like that. a record yet let's see if we do with the fixing of these bugs nope well it's still a decent uh, decent game Got leveled some stuff up but I just mean that first reviews for Taja teachers typing have come in mm-hmm okay Hmm, what a beautiful typing teaching game. And here's the wild card. Nope. They're not very they're not demonstrating their wild card status very well. Oh well. Let's see. Generate a game report. Okay. Okay. I don't think I'm actually going to need that. TBH. What does it say? Yep. Okay. Let's see. I can find some contract work. But they don't pay a whole lot, so. Let's see. I'm not going to make a new game engine yet. Mm. How about a hospital game? I think I'm I think I'm settling into a kind of sim and strategy kind of mold here, but I don't really want to just develop for PC the whole time because it's a little boring. What other consoles are good for those? Mm. Okay, nothing else is will ever be as good as the PC and G sixty four for strategy in this, and then Sim, you get the um, get the Super TES and the Dreamvast, and then the New and the PS3, and then the Woo and the PS5. So I could, and then what? What about um, like how how are they on? Uh, TX64, mm, they're only okay, so I might take a break and do something else for that one. I mean, TX64 isn't really good at anything. It's got no triple pluses. It's best at action and casual. So, I mean, Gamesphere is best at casual, and that's got three pluses. How is Hospital with uh? It's best at sim and not really good at anything else. <laughs> so, kind of limited there. Maybe let's do spy. Oh, TS is out. Let's see. TS is great for casual, but I'm not sure you can get casual at this point. Mm. Let's wait for the game link and make some sims for that. Maybe some casuals. Before we switch from PC, I mean. Okay. What's Spy good with? Hmm. Action adventure and RPG. Let's make a spy adventure for the PC. Sounds like a good idea. Um, so we got <clears throat> spy, we got adventure, and we've got yep PC. 
Now, what to call this game? I could just continue to fillet myself more and do like a soliloquy reference, but I feel like Taja te teacher's typing was just a little joke and I shouldn't do that again. <laughs> Any suggestions for 006? No, it will be 600. 600. God, Dante, Dante, do you remember fucking 500 from Aqua Blade Chronicles? Here we go, 600, the world's worst spy. <laughs> so we want good story quests. I mean, this is basically telling it for me, it's just not certain, because it doesn't always necessarily apply to every combination, but I'm pretty sure something like that. Probably leaned a little too hard on gameplay there, should have given more to story quests. Oh well. <clears throat> okay, I want this all the way at the bottom. This up here. And yeah, let's you know what? Let's just go really good dialogues. I have a feeling this is gonna turn out shit. Cause I don't really know what I'm doing. Okay, well design we want up there. Sound doesn't matter. Graphics like that. You'll want about one million before you move out of this office. We've reached a new design record. That's something. Oh shit. Okay. Oh, got one more technology point. Well, I leveled up in almost everything, so that's that's good. <coughs> okay, I'm just gonna go wash my hands because I just finished eating my snackaroonies. See how these reviews go. I'm predicting four out of ten. Okay. Are we leaning six seven? Oh, okay. All right. Hey, awesome. Okay, so that's what um, seven point two five. Okay, well, this is actually better than Taja Teacher's typing. Alright. Let's research another topic. Oh, racing. Gotta make a racing game. What is racing good with? Probably like simulation. PC is great at simulation, so I could make. Uh, let's see. R -r 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 racing. Yep, simulation and casual. So I'm gonna make a racing sim for PC. Develop new game. Racing sim for PC. There's the TES. Uh, if I had casual games, I might make it a uh, casual for NES and beat Nintendo to their own, own Mario Kart game and maybe do that. But I haven't unlocked casual games yet because you have to unlock it for some reason. Right, what should it be called? Maybe something about light speed. Uh, maybe. Oh no, no, no! I got. It's got to be like a fucking Eurobeat. Um, initial D game. Call it initial D. Um, what's the opposite of initial? Like final. I guess. Because final I usually think of as the opposite of first. 
Like, I know obviously they're opposites anyway, but I mean, like, specifically. For, no, first is with last. So I guess it's initial and final. So, and D is the fourth letter of the alphabet. W, X, Y, Z. So it would be final W. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> and I'll eventually turn that into a franchise, I think, and I'll name the subtitles after lyrics from Eurobeat songs. That'll be good. Okay, what am I doing? Um, so it's a sim, so we want gameplay first, pretty good engine, story quests don't matter. Oop. How can we not have a good engine in a racing game? Ha ha ha. Let's see, we want good AI, we want some pretty good level design, because it's a racing game, we've got to have them good tracks. Dialogue doesn't matter. Can't mark it yet, because I don't have the research. Let me just check. Yeah. Okay, and... Sim. Yep. Well, design doesn't matter. Keep doing that. Habit. Okay. TES has been a massive success. Okay. Alright. Let's wait until these bugs finish. That's, that's a pretty good split. We're also getting up there in the research points. I'm glad about that. And we've got one more tech point. Cool. Is this record for both? Uh, just tech. That's fine then. Cause like yeah, I had an 18 with design before. Okay, let's see how this goes. Uh, oh. oh, almost got my first 10 of this run. Ah, okay. Well, still doing pretty alright though. I'm glad because I wanted to turn this into a franchise. Okay, 8.5 is not bad at all. I think that's the best we've done so far, right? Let's see, we got 7.25, 8.25, 7, 7.25, yeah. Okay, let's generate a game report, get some more research points. Okay. Yeah, blood design is not important. Okay. Um, Shall I see what topics there are? Post apocalyptic. I did make a post apocalyptic um, game before. Maybe let's do medieval because I didn't have that before. So, medieval. Oh, it goes well with a lot of stuff. I haven't made an RPG yet. Let's make a medieval RPG. Wait, no, I have made an RPG. Medieval action. It's good with that. Let's do a medieval action game. Excuse me. Um. Oh, I've already got medieval. I'm done. Okay, let's develop a new game. It will be a medieval action game. And is action good for PC? I think it's not as good as... Uh... There's nothing better for action anyway. G64 is just as good. And we won't get a triple plus on action until Venno Oasis and then placed it play system and stuff. <laughs> okay. So PC will do. Plus you have to buy licenses for other stuff. Okay. What what will this game be? It's a medieval action game. So that sounds kinda like Dark Souls. Um <laughs> Oh, hello, Remix 27 UK. I haven't seen you around before. I'm trying to think of a silly name for my medieval action game. Thinking of playing off of uh, Dark Souls, but it's a bit obvious, so maybe not. Uh, doing all right? Just, um, just streaming. <laughs> Should probably not be taking this long to think of a name while I'm on, uh, on stream, but I don't know. So let's go with, 
Let's just let's just pick something. It'll be fucking mouse. <laughs> um. Not mouse knight. How about um. Mm. Mouse souls. Mm. Yeah, I don't know. Dark souls is a little too obvious. Maybe something similar. Um. What it's mouse souls? Uh, I feel like it. Um. Yeah, okay. Let's not think about it too hard. Mouse souls. Sure. You play as a, a cool mouse. Final W is a surprise hit with players. The developer of Charmer Yellow. <laughs> Fucking hell, I forgot I named myself that. Okay. Let's see. Uh, by the way, I, I mentioned this earlier, but since you just showed up. Um, I'm a complete scrub, and I use walkthroughs for this game. But I have more fun that way, so... You know what? Who cares? Um... Let's see. We want that, that, something like that. Okay, that's right, basically fine. Yeah. Um, oh yeah, I know about that. Okay, that's fine. Oh, now I can research target audience. I'll do that after I'm done making this game. It's a shame. I could have, uh, I could have made this, uh, if I wasn't so, if I hadn't rushed so much, I could have made this, like, aimed at mature audiences, because I think PC's good for that, yeah. Oh well. Yeah, I know, I know I can make an engine, I just need graphics. Um, speaking of, what do I want to do here? Okay, I'm basically fine like this. Okay. Final W is off the market. I named Final W after Initial D, by the way. Vena, yep, yep. Okay. This should do. Uh oh. Oh, is that this? Okay. Yep, seems alright. I always panic whenever it seems to flicker down to some low numbers. Alright, did well. So far, I've been doing pretty alright. Uh, touch wood, knock on head. I mean, in, in my um, previous run, when I re obtained this game last month, it was a lot more mixed. So, what was that? An 8.25, I think? Okay. Let's generate a game report to get a bit more research, and then maybe because I don't, I don't remember if I already have um, like two D graphics v one or if I have to research them because it's telling me it's like trying to prompt me to make a custom game engine. Um. Oh, you have to research it as a topic. I'm dumb. Mouse Souls definitely does deserve a sequel. I think that's going to be one of my franchises. Uh, however, this game is a little bit dumb in that you don't have to, you, you can't make, like, mechanical sequels until, um, un until you, like, specifically unlock it. And I didn't know that the first time I played this, and I made a, a game called Morph Story, and then I made Morph Story 2, and it's like, you've got sequels, and so everything after that had to be a sequel to Morph Story 2, and it was weird, because it, it thought the franchise was Morph Story 2. <sighs> anyway, um, Informed Gamer. Okay. Yep, Master V. Um, I mentioned this earlier, but my first run, um, I <clears throat> started out mixed as you usually do, and then I eventually kind of started to focus on like RPGs for the play system consoles. Lol. Um, I have actually gone negative before. What happens is that the bank gives you a loan, and then you try to make games quickly and uh, pay back the loan, which I managed to do, so. Okay. Now I can make custom engine. No, it's okay. Um, right. Uh, top.
target audience is is a very useful um, thing throughout the game, so I'll do that now. Okay. Okay. Hopefully, I can get out of this uh, this office quick. Okay. Let's research something else. Let's do mono sound. Just do that, and then uh, I think. I don't know when I'll unlock um, like the better graphics, cause I'm on I'm on like basic graphics, right? Oop, sorry, there we go. Um, oh no, I do. Oh, huh. Oh, I guess I start with these. Okay, yeah, I'll probably make an engine now. Let me save actually, just in case uh, thing bad happens. <coughs> so, what should I name this engine? I went with a really dumb theming of having like stuff to do with body parts, then clothes, then methods of travel, and then map on the end. So I went like foot map, but uh, sorry, foot map, boot map, hat map, boat, uh, coat map, boat map, shuttle map. I think. I don't know why, but um. Oh, uh, okay. See you, Jurati. Uh, well, I'm gonna put everything in this. 120, I can afford that. Um, let's see. Mm, I gotta do something stupid. I can't just go with a standard, like, I don't even know what a standard name would be, but I can't, I can't just go for something like, oh, alpha, beta, gamma. Gotta do something dumb. I mean the the engine name is going to be something that I've got to keep the naming convention for throughout the whole game so it's it's important to think of a dumb name for this, you know. Um, though I honestly don't know what I'm going to do for it. Could name them after, like, drinks throughout life. So, like, milk, juice... Like cola, um, uh, like beer, coffee, or something, but I don't know. Could work, and that's roughly enough to last me throughout the whole game. So okay, that'll be the start. It'll be milk, and then uh. Milk, uh, I don't know. I guess just sip, milk sip, milk sip, juice sip. It's dumb enough, let's just go for it. Okay, milk sip custom game engine. Let's go. And I'm getting research points for it, which is useful. <coughs> I can start making slightly better games too. Should help me reach that uh one million goal. Okay, milk sip is made. Let's develop a new game. Wait, what can I get with my research? 
New topic. Oh yeah, post-apocalyptic. Um, can't do sequels yet, so I should probably... I'm running out of a... I've done all of these topics except for school. Um, we're making a lot of sims. Let's make like a city sim. I'll be able to specialize a bit more once... I, I think the, the kind of cycle for this game is that you make like four or five franchises and then... You just start cycling between them, make one of each every console generation, then you don't really have to research topics anymore because you've just got a set of things you can use. Um, Alright, let's make a city sim game. It's, it's good for that, right? Sim. It can be a sim or strategy. I've done more sims, so I'm going to do a strategy. Um... And everyone is fine. PC. And of course, gonna use my new engine, Milk Sip. Right. I don't know why this game is glitching out like this. It doesn't usually do that. Like it's it's letting me interact with parts of the background sometimes. It's weird. Oh, there there we go. Look, it's doing it right now. Whatever. Um. Hmm. One second, I'm gonna look something up. Let's just call it Gothic Revival. It will be about fucking Gothic architecture, sure. We don't need a story, but um, let's see, strategy, okay, something like that. This has got to be at least a little okay. <laughs> Sounds like that. <laughs> oh, now I can research casual games. Okay. Might be useful. Yeah, Velvet 64 is dying. Okay. Oh, cool. Reached 20 design. Oh, new records for both. Nice. Generate game report. Oh. Now generate a game report. There we go. Don't know the score yet. Oh boy. Oh. Hey, our first ten. Oh, hi Nico. How's it going? My um gothic architecture city game is doing well. I got a ten out of ten from one uh reviewer. And another. Nice. I'm really happy with that. <coughs> now, if I can follow this up with something great, then that'll... Oh, I'm already out of 1.1. Oh, no, I remember. I think I want to get to, like, 1.5 million. Yeah, I'll wait just a bit. I'll see if I can get to 1.5 million, then I'll move. Oh, I'm at 1.5 million. Okay, next time it asks me... Assuming that I haven't, like, dropped all the way down into debt or something. 
Oh boy. And I'm gonna reach two, aren't I? Yep. Damn. Oh, game link. I wanted to wait for that before making. What did I want to make? I don't even remember. Game link or headshot. Okay, I'm gonna develop for the game link. Um, let's see if I can research a new topic. Oh no, I wanted to. Hang on, the game link's good for casual, right? Good for young. Uh, yeah, young and casual, so. Okay. School is good for young. Oh, I've got aliens as a possible topic now. I guess I can research aliens. Maybe I can make a, something out of that later. What are aliens good with? Action RPG, I'll probably make an alien RPG. That'd be good. Okay, and I'll research casual games straight after. I'm playing Game Dev Tycoon. Uh, I'm currently researching things before I make my next game, but I've made quite a name for myself. I jumped up from approximately 0 0.8 million cash and I'm or almost at 2.8 million. Yeah, so, oh, hello. Let's see, research, casual games. And then I'm gonna make a casual school game for the gameling, I think. Perfect, just got released. <coughs> what game? School casual for gameling. Yeah, I'll, I'll buy a license. Uh, Milk sip. All right, what should I name this? Uh, this game. It's a casual school game for the gameling, which is the Game Boy. Um, for the record, there is no gameling color or gameling advance. It's just considered to be those as well, and it sticks around until the end of the Game Boy Advance's usual life cycle. So. I can just kind of be a, a gameling developer for a little while, not have to pay more licenses. Um, clearly I'll make an active shooter, except not really. <laughs> um, no one even knows what I'm talking about. What's like a pun to do with school that I can... Um, how about Alma Master instead of like Alma Mater? I'm not calling it Beyond the Uncanty Valley. Alma Master. Yeah, that's a dumb enough name. Oh, wow. Okay. Um. Um. Where am I? School. Wait. School isn't good for casual? Really? 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 Well, this isn't going to do so well. <laughs> That's weird. Okay, well, I am still making a casual, so let's see how this works. It should work out as a category otherwise. Okay, gameplay first, engine and story and quest don't matter. Don't even need that. Probably don't even need that, to be honest. I'm just, like, min-maxing the hell out of this one. See how it goes. Except for the fact that school is not that great with, uh casual according to this, which is weird because it makes sense to me, but whatever. Um, let's see, I want that and then, wow, okay, just want it like this apparently. Let's see, let's, let's see how it goes. Shoop. Um, that doesn't matter at all. I can do that. Sure. Oh boy, really, really reaching those peaks with design and tech points here. No, I'm not doing so bad. I might reach a decent design. Can I reach like an 18 on design? 20 maybe? Marketing, okay, thank you. That'll be useful. Right. Will this game have been worth the 50,000 I spent on the, uh... Well, leveled up a bit, that's something. Will it be worth the 50000 I spent on the gaming license? You know, not that I'm not going to use that on anything else, but whatever. Quiet name. Yeah, yeah, okay, I'll move. Okay. 
First reviews for Alma Master. Yep, okay, it's real bad. It's real bad. It's re Oh, it's a six. This is a six out of ten. Could be worse. Oh, no. That's a... Okay. Mm-hmm. Well, they like it. Casual games work well in game lane. Yeah, I know. Okay. Well, could have done worse. Could have done better. How will it sell? Let's research. Uh, where's, where's research? Oh, I need to click on a person now. That's why. Let's research. Um, I can't research marketing yet. Okay, I'll generate a game report and then that will give me enough. Oof, yeah. For record, here's my game history. Uh, 7.25, 8.25, 7, 7.25, 8.5, 8.25, 9.5. 6.25 So that's why I'm a little disappointed because I made a good starting uh, starting out in this I only got I only got like six points from that really Jesus Okay, um, can I get research points from doing some contract work maybe let's do some contract work um, That looks easy Then a gear no, I'm sticking with game lane Uh, I might not make this. Three, two, one. Okay, I'm good. And I didn't quite get enough research points. Excellent. Okay. Come on, I gotta research fucking marketing. Do one more piece of contract work. That looks relatively simple. Come on, give me more research points. There we go. Now I'll be able to do that. And I'm getting a bit of cash in the meantime. Okay. More cash. Let's have you research marketing while I fill a position. Oh, I need to do staff management training. God damn it. Probably should have uh, gotten some staff first. Then train them and then got one of them to research while I did something else or something. Whatever. It's, oh, wait, I can't. Hang on. Oh, here we go. So, okay, good. You don't need any research points for that. Apparently my encoding is overloaded. Is the game, dis is the game displaying fine for you guys on the stream? Let's see. You want balanced people. Oh, that's not good. Well, you know what? Sure. Oh, I can research medium games already. Excuse me, why are you like... Do I need to... What's going on here? Do I need a break? I don't know. Let's train him. Staff welcome training. I guess that's what it is. Oh, Govador filed for bankruptcy. Rip. Like, what's your deal? Well, we can't research anything else, so let's develop like a, a small game. Um, yeah, let's make an aliens Is RPG good on game lane. Better than action. Let's see if I was smart. Well, no, actually, RPG is just as okay on PC. How are aliens with, uh... Yeah, whatever. Let's make an alien-based RPG for the game link. Okay, and we'll call this, uh... Um... 
Plan 9 from Boska Tekovic. I'm not going to explain this reference, but... Is that how you spell it? I think so. Let's go. Okay. <coughs> Let's see how this goes. Doing all right. Already at ooh, 14 design before stage three. Um, and yeah, we want well design and, and the same like that. Mm, looking good. Gonna have some pretty high design points here. It's gonna break break the record. Knack for security. Yeah. Okay. Not bad. Oh, world design graphics leveled up. I leveled up. We can research open worlds. I think I'm gonna save my research so I can research medium games there. All right, reviews. Yep, all right. Aw, oh, come on. Okay, 7.75. Can you generate a game report for me? Meanwhile, I... If only I had the ability to do sequels. Oh, I can do. I can research media games. What am I talking about? Let me do that. Uh, I probably won't actually utilize that until later. But yeah, let's do one more piece of contract work so we can get ten research points to research like a new topic or something for our next game. Um. Oh yeah, publishers. Maybe I'll do that sometime. It's not that great. Okay. Um, no, it's contract work. So uh, that'll do. Okay. Cool. Okay. Right. Let's do some more research. Hmm. Zombies. We can make like a mature PC zombies game. That could work. Let me just close this ping. Okay, let's develop a medium game. It's gonna cost us a bit more. No, you know what? Let's keep it small still. Um, zombies are, I'm assuming, good for ac action and casual? That's odd. I guess that's probably just because of plants versus zombies. <coughs> let's do, um, let's do action though, and then... Action's good on P... Uh, uh... Mm. Action's alright on PC, so we'll make it, we'll make it a zombie action, zombies action game. Yes. Yes. Zonduli. Yes. I will name it Zonduli. Um. Uh, action. Something like that. Do even really need a story? It's min max. Bitch. Okay. Uh, and then that 
doesn't matter. Something like that. Okay. Looks like we're gonna hit pretty good uh some pretty good numbers here. Oh, is that it? Okay, twenty one technology I can I can deal with that. That's fine, we got a we got a record. You wanna try to get a record in at least one of these every every game you make, pretty much. Better dialogues, okay. I can research that, no problem. Mm, not looking so good. Did I forget to make it for mature audiences? I think I did. I think that's the problem. Oh, well. Oh. Nothing much I can do about that. Let's save. You give me a game report. Meanwhile, I will research. Hmm, I should probably do some of these other features instead of just doing new topics all the time, especially because we're probably going to get sequels soon, so then we won't have to worry about new topics so much. I think we've kind of reached what we need to. Um, if I'm going to be doing a lot of kind of sims and stuff, I probably don't need the dialogues. The dialogue. Gameplay is usually useful. Let's do, like, better user experience. Van Oasis. Okay, well, we basically broke even on that. That's all right. Um, let's see. Let's make a new game. Is there a topic we haven't done that done yet? No, we've done all the topics. Hmm. Gonna have to reuse one for something else. Let's do like a medieval strategy game, and it'll be a spin-off of uh, Mouse Souls. Medieval good strategy. Are they? Medieval strategy. Yep. Okay. Um. That'll do. For the PC probably. And this will be called mouse. Um. Mouse Souls Empire. Sure. I accidentally unplugged my headphones. Okay. Sure. Let's go. Mm. I can never remember this. Um, strat is it strategy? Something like that. I can put it in a little story. Why not? <coughs> we need to get out of our rut. We're a little, uh, we're stagnating a little bit. Okay. Where's the super TES? Don't know. Um. Zonduli's off the market. Okay, how's this? It's a pretty okay ratio. You need a break, so you can take one as soon as we're done here. Okay, no new record, but 20 is not bad for this stage in the game. Oh, okay, we can do a bunch of research. You go on vacation. Okay. Oh, that doesn't look good. Oh, wait. Okay, eight. Good. All right. Don't fucking fake me out there with that seven. No. Right, what are you giving me? 
Seven. Seven point five. Could be worse. Generate game report. Uh, since the game lane can't do 3D, I think I'm actually gonna. Simulation games are especially popular. Are Sims good for game lane. Better than strategy. Let's see. What have we got that would be good for that? I want to be able to just make sequels already, to be honest. Um, yep, yep. Okay. Let's, re let's see what we can research. Oh yeah, 2D graphics v3 takes a lot, so it's probably better to just go for 3D graphics. Meanwhile, you can research um, my big gay dance. Game tutorials are useful. Simple cutscenes. They'll be useful if I want to make RPGs. I'm thinking. I'm actually leaning more towards kind of Sims and strategies this time around because I did a lot of RPGs the first time I ran through this game. I don't want to every run to be the same. But who knows? It might turn out otherwise. I'll probably end up researching that stuff anyway if I get enough research points. Can you can you maybe hurry up? Okay. Let's develop a new game. No, let's save first. Okay, develop a new game. Uh, topics. What do I? What do I got? Uh, I don't. What was, uh, maybe I can make a spin-off of that spy game I made, or something. Spy Adventure. Okay, let's make it like a spy, what's, what's spy good for? Spy is good for action, adventure, and RPG. What's PC good for? Well, mostly adventure out of those, that's why I did that. Um... Yeah, action, uh, and then it's also good for mature audiences, which suggests I should make it for PC. I, I want this to be a sequel, but I can't really do that. Um, um, gameling is not, yeah. Okay, let's not make it a spy game then, because... Can't really do better than making a mature adventure spy game for PC, and that would just be a sequel, basically. So let's um, see what other topics we've got. Could do another colonization game. Seems kind of limited in what it's about, though. Well, that one was. Bit, well, the other colonization game was. What did I even call that? Oh, bivalization. This one, maybe it can be like themed slightly differently. Um, yeah, let's make a let's make a colonization game. What's colonization good for? Sim and strategy. Um, and last time I did. Let's check again. I think that was a sim. No, it was a strategy. Let's do a let's do a sim. Um, sim is good for PC, good for mature. Colonization is probably good for mature as well. No, it's only okay for mature. Let's do this. It'll be everyone then. Okay, I've decided that it will be a colonization game for everyone. It will be a sim. It will be for PC. It will use this engine. Excuse me, and it will be called. Um, what should I theme it around? Maybe it can be like a space colonization game. That's why it's more of a sim. Um, just 
just call it panspermia after that, like, the concept of, um, life on planets being started by other aliens planting DNA there. Could just call it that. It's got sperm in the name, which is funny. Um, collector, collector cosmos. Yeah, that sounds okay. Coco for short. It's just as stupid as anything else. Let's go. <coughs> right. What do I want here? Make it a sim. That's fine, actually, for a ratio. How long have I been going for? Hour 16, not bad. Um, something like this. And then we want this high, we want this pretty good, that doesn't matter so much. Okay, doing pretty well on these points actually. Glad about that. Let's go one more. Okay. Oh. Oh boy. Ooh, very special offer. Fucking no thanks. You get like fined if you take that. It doesn't really help you that much. Alright, new tech record. Let's go. Hey, he leveled up, so he's got a raise. Uh oh, and Sims are popular right now. Perfect. Let's see how this goes. Oh, Doing well, doing well. Nine, not bad. Oh, I thought I was going to be a seven for a second. I was like, what? Okay, eight. Ooh, a ten. Nice. Glad that review, I liked it. And a nine. So, all together, it's a nine. That's pretty good. I think that's the best game I've made, actually. And it's going to sell well, because Sims are popular right now. So that is great. I will generate a game report as well to get more research points and then maybe we can get a couple more things and then maybe think about making a new engine soon because we're six years in. Come on. Yep. Yeah. Thanks. I appreciate it. I definitely made that game with my own bare hand instead of just sliding a bunch of sliders. Um, Okay, let's see what we got. What do we, what do we got that I can research? Could do a new topic. What's the next one? UFO. I could do that. That could be a spin-off of that alien game. Kind of want to do one of these though. Sto uh, simple cutscenes helps with story and quests. Let's. Uh, I never did level editor before. I feel like that could be useful or just interesting. I guess. Let's do level editor. And then afterwards, let's do some contract work to get like a 15 research thing, and then maybe make um, make an engine. That'll give me a lot of research points too. So contract work. Uh, do this one then. <coughs> Can I get one more research point bit? There we go. Collector Cosmos is off the market. So pretty well. Okay, money, uh, research, mm, open world, why not? You, um, can I train you in anything? No, I need more for that. You got pretty decent speed, I think. Oh, there we go, there's a TES. Okay, and I'll just wait, and then we can make an engine. And then maybe I can research something. Or do some training, actually. Yep, okay, custom engine. Actually, no, I'm going to save before making this. Okay, custom engine. Oops, this is going to be... The games industry, am I right, ladies? Yep, you're just in time for me to make a new game engine. Don't need 2D graphics v2 anymore. Those, 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 those. I haven't got better sound, unfortunately, but oh well. I think I have to do like a lot of games that focus on sound to, to go down that, that tree. I say tree, it's uh, really just a path. 
Okay, market normalized again. That's good. Though. That's just fine though, because I managed to capitalize on it with that colonization sim game I made. Uh, okay, five research points. That'll be enough to train. Uh, what's his name? Tom Timothy. Uh, Timothy here. Super TES is released. Okay. New game. New game engine. Juice sip is released. <laughs> the first one's called Milk Sip. I'm gonna go Milk Sip, Juice Sip, Cola Sip. Um, maybe soda sip or something, uh, like beer sip, um, coffee sip, and then like wine sip or something, if I get that far, we'll see. Um, I don't remember what these do, which is annoying because the effect would have been learned in the previous playthrough. I think, no, I honestly have no idea. I think this is design. This is... I honestly have no idea. Let's just let's just work out. I think this one's for tech. This technology is a little lacking. We kind of want um, balanced people, but I, f I actually failed to do the balanced people. So I think I think maybe it might just be in my best interest to get someone who's good at tech next or something. So in that case, I want to do like improve his speed or something. I think that I think this is speed. Yeah, speed and research. Okay, that's good. Cool. And I'll do some contract work, and then I'll uh, and then I'll train myself, and then I'll make a game. Mhm. Mm ah, uh, I am hemorrhaging a little bit of money. Oh, I've been forgetting to do marketing. I'm a goddamn idiot. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, no contract work. Let's just make a fucking game. And let's actually remember to do marketing this time. Jesus Christ. My mouse seems slightly off. Ah. Would it be beneficial for me to, um... Oh, are you just talking about this, like, thing right next to it? Because I don't know why that's happening or how to fix it. it. Like, are you just talking about the thing underneath the... I can turn off my cursor if it's annoying. Just give me a second. Um... Properties... No. Is this really supposed to be that? Oh, there we go. Yeah, don't capture my cursor then. Okay. Where's the chat? There we go. Um, right. Uh, oh, I don't have any new topics. Damn it. Uh, no, you know what? Let's just develop a new game. It will be, oh, what are these good at? Fantasy, I can make a fantasy, oh, fantasy's good at a lot of things, actually. What did I make before, like a fantasy adventure, fantasy RPG? Let's make a fantasy adventure game. And, um, be for the PC. It'll be a medium game, let's make it, Let's make it quite a, let's, let's make this bit, you know, a bit of a Bugs Bunny's birthday blowout here. Yeah. Looks like I was mousing over the option. Yeah, okay, that's why I thought you meant it originally, and then I just saw the other thing. Um, hopefully me turning off the cu cursor capture should make that better. I'm not sure why I was doing it in the first place, but, oh well, nothing much I can do about that. Okay, um, fantasy adventure, is fantasy good for, which, oh yes, okay, let's make this mature, because that'll work well with PC. Um... Let's see. Um, fantasy can be a lot of things. Adventure encompasses stuff like mystery games. It's not like it's not really supposed to be stuff like Zelda, as far as I'm aware. So it's kind of like a fantasy. It's not a mystery because mystery is its own genre, but it's like a, it's that kind of thing, like a point and click. So, maybe something to do with Atlantis. Atlantis is kind of mysterious. Oh, I should totally base it on the fucking hidden human history movie. God damn. Um,. Oh my god, what do I even, what do I even call it? 
What do I reference? What Thoth told us. Uh, yeah, Zelda would be like action. It's it's kind of these these genres are kind of broad because there's only six of them. Yeah, I'm gonna call it what Thoth told us. <laughs> you have 3D graphics. Let's go. <coughs> um, engine doesn't matter. Oh yeah, we have to assign stuff starting with medium games. Um, that's a new thing. So let me just check. Master quest. Okay. So. Oh boy, your design and shit isn't very good. Um, I'll assign myself there, you can do the other two. Best game 2018. Well, actually, this is year six, year seven now. Seven years after uh, the kind of the period when PC and, G6 and C64 were the only things on the market. So I'm, I'm, I'm thinking this is like 1991 at the moment. Um, let's add a level ed, so why not? Except we don't really need to, it'll be a waste of money. Um, is that right? Yeah. So, you know what, you can do the dialogues. And then I'll basically handle the rest of it. I think it's supposed to have three people for making medium games, so I'll probably hire someone else if this does well enough. Uh, I'll, if it doesn't do well, then I'll just switch back to small games for a while. Um, let's give an interview. Thanks. Okay. Also, this is when we should do marketing, so let's do... Smallest marketing campaign. I don't have a whole lot of money. Uh, oh yeah, the play system. Oh, okay, now we got a little bit of hype. And then, yeah, this is the whole Nintendo and PlayStation thing. Ow. Um, so we want... World design, definitely. If that guy had anything, it was fucking world design. Um, and I'll go here... And you can go there, and I'll go here. Mm. Okay, you're gonna be overworked, but that's why. Yep. Yeah. Did I did I say that? Okay. Sure. Um, let them be. You get you get more fans that way. You just get like a little bit of money if you stop fan games. Hint, hint, Nintendo. We don't even really get money. They don't even really get money in real life, but they had to give you some kind of incentive to do it. Okay. Let's see. Uh, Denise Reed. Yeah, we didn't we didn't stop because we're nice people. Thanks. We've gained two hundred eighty eight fans, so yeah, fans are useful. Let's see. Oh no! No! What did I do wrong? What the fuck? Is it because I overworked myself while I was, uh, yeah, probably. Falls a bit short. All right, let's just get this over with. Didn't do well. I get it. Disappointing. As its moments. Okay, you go the fuck on vacation right now. Meanwhile, I guess I'll generate a game report to get some research points. Jesus Christ. All right. You can do some research, I guess. Maybe a new topic. You know, I'll just fucking just fucking research UFOs. I'm getting more research points from this anyway. Quite a lot. Hey, over thirty-one. So we can even research. You know, let's, let's save up a bit. I don't really need simple cutscenes or better dialogues. Let's wait until we can get like. Um. I don't know. Uh, okay, yeah, we shouldn't do it until we uh, until we get more fans. Damn. Publishing deals can give us exposure. Why the fuck am I hemorrhaging money? We've just been losing money for like two years. Sim games are popular. All right, fine. We'll make a sim game. Um, do UFO sims work well? Can I do that? Please. No, UFO strategy works. What works with, uh, do, do zombies work with strategy? What, no, sim games, sorry. They don't. We could make another vocabulary sim, but I don't think that's a really good idea. If I had fucking sequels, 
I don't know why I have to unlock sequels, but if I had sequels, I could make a sequel to that racing game or something. But no. Um... <sighs> medieval sim would probably work fine. No, medieval sim isn't even that good. God damn it. School sim, maybe? School sim is good. Okay, let's make a school sim. And what will that be for? School is good on... For young audiences. Which consoles are good for young audiences? Gameling. So it'll be a school sim for... Is our sims good on gameling? They're, they're alright. They're pretty good. Let's, let's go gameling. Juice sip. Why am I being pinged? It's that fucking server again. Uh, okay. And what will this be called? Oh, no, I want to market that to everyone as well. Or well, young, sorry. Middle school mayhem. No, um, <sighs> it's not. It's not quite ninety two yet. Oh, but yeah, that's fair. They do do it like in advance. Okay. Um, I like the idea of arbitrarily putting the year in the name. That's that's a good idea. Um. I'm not gonna call it school sim, but I will. Go, I will go with something ninety two. I actually, I actually joked about making a fucking school sim called Active Shooter earlier. You can check the vod if you want. Class of ninety two. Sure, why not? No, wait. You can't do three D graphics on the game link. <laughs> Whoops. I wonder how that will work. Let's see. Um, simulation. Engine and gameplay. Uh, okay, that's fine. Yeah, I've been dipping below two million a lot. I had a really strong start. I moved into this office quite quick, but then it's just it's just been downhill from here. Um, want good AI. Want good level design, and then doesn't matter. Level editor, sure, you can generate your own school or whatever. That's fine. Let's do a marketing campaign. <coughs> When's the first year that E3 happens? Any or G3 happens anyway? Don't really need open world. Uh, they'll do. We get like a random ad or something, interview, promo. Getting a lot of research points, that's good at least. I can probably research a new topic now. Okay. 21 a record? No. No records. Lid level up gameplay and uh, 3D graphics though, so that's good. Character progression, I'll probably research that. You, generate. You, generate. You, generate game report. There we go. What Thoth told us. Oh, here we go. <sighs> what is this? I was doing I was doing everything right. The, this game has way too many random factors for it to be like quite good enough for me to like really enjoy it. I do enjoy this game overall, but I really just fucking wish that shit like this wouldn't happen when you've done everything correctly. It's really it really pisses me off. Okay, let's do some research. Um Oh, this takes 40? Okay. Well, good thing I'm getting some points from this, so that you can research a new topic for me. What's next? Abstract! That sounds fun. Okay, post-release analysis. Okay, so I, I did well. What the fuck? I don't know. 
Yep, we're basically breaking even still. Really annoying. Okay. Now what the hell is abstract good with? Adventure mostly, and with action it's alright too. All about audiences. Mature great. Let's make a let's make an abstract adventure game for PC for mature audiences. How about that? Mature abstract PC Juicep Um Maybe something to do with dreams, because they're, they're pretty abstract. Paintings can be abstract. Curse of Enchantia, what's that a reference to? I got her. I got her. Is it any too long? What what did I do wrong? Oh I didn't pick genre, that's that's why. Um Adventure. Story for North America. Yeah, I am not aiming to recreate any real games. Um I might make like ripoffs with different names, but anyway. Engine doesn't matter. Um, okay. I'm gonna make a story from North America game like 15 years before it actually exists. Um, Go for some marketing. <coughs> see world design. Yeah, it doesn't matter as much. Graphics are probably important for abstract games. So I'll, pick, I'll have that pretty high. I'm just guessing. Well, we're getting a pretty high design score here, so that's good. We breached 30. No, I'm not gonna fucking accept your stupid corporate espionage. Okay. Not bad. Okay. How's it gonna go? Let's see. Looks. Promising? Okay, eight. You never really know until you get your first score. It can be misleading, but okay. Seems like it's pretty well overall. I forgot to fucking move the thing by my window. Hope I didn't break it. Mm. Okay, well, that'll have to do. Generate a game report, please. Are we gonna finally make some profit? Maybe? <laughs> okay, finally. We were stuck on like two million for a while there. Um, can you research anything useful? Not really. A new topic? Hacking. I'm fine. Okay. If I were to, oh. oh, okay, finally, G3. Okay, let's save then. So G3 is coming up. Uh, we should probably start developing a game for that. Actually, we can wait a little bit. Let's, if I were to create a custom engine right now, I couldn't add much to it. 
So let's see what publishing deals there are. Just just look around. Any topic strategy for any console. Mm, medieval sim. Not sure about that. Um, let's do a bit of contract work, maybe. Do some playtesting. Just get a little bit of money. Just pass some time while not wasting any of it. Could do some training, I guess. But no, I think I'm alright. Okay, money's good. Sorry for North America. Let's see. They're gonna contact us soon, so let's save. Develop a new game. Start making something. This can be a UFO game, because I haven't made one of those yet. UFO is good with action and strategy. I could follow up that publishing deal about strategy, actually, except I think they reset every time you open this. It says, no, it says any topic strategy. Okay. Let's accept this contract and make a UFO game. UFO strategy game. Um, UFOs are good with everyone. So, PC, and it will be Juice Sip, and it will be aimed at everyone. And what should I call it? Some, something to do with UFOs. If Jorati was here, I bet you would suggest UFO porno, but I'm not going to do that. Abduction arcade, maybe. You know, it can feel kind of arcadey, like it's just a, it's just a game where you just go around being a UFO and trying to. It can be like Cookie Clicker. It can be like Cookie Clicker, but you're a fucking UFO system just trying to get loads of cows. That could work. Oops. Drop some dice. Martians invade Limer. I'm not fucking naming it after that. God damn it. <laughs> Didn't even come in a UFO. They came through a Merkaba. If anything, I would, um, it'd be some kind of reference to the stupid three atom thick spaceship under the Sphinx or whatever. <laughs> you know, I'll, I'll reference that just by calling it Sub Sphinx something. Sub Sphinx spaceship. You know what? Go on. Let's fucking Sub Sphinx spaceship. Sub Sphinx spaceship. That's a fucking tongue twister. Okay, let's go. We're doing it. <laughs> okay, um, let's see. Oh, yeah, Mr. Krabs. Uh... All right, what am I doing? Scroll down to, what is this, a strategy. So on gameplay is king, like that. Story, we don't really need that. I will go on... can do these two. <laughs> Not calling it Sub Sphinx Emissary. Maybe like a spin off or a sequel can be called that. Wait. Um. Okay, now we're going to be overworked as soon as we head into this last bit, but that's okay. Oh, shit. I, I panicked there because I thought this was coming up with part three, and I'm like, no, I haven't done my, ma my marketing yet. Uh, small booth is fine. Let's do some marketing as well. <coughs> Get a bit of hype, and then hopefully, because uh, it's month six, week two, so we got one month until G3, so this will be perfect if we release just after that. Um... We want better sound. I'll um I'll go here. You can do the other two. Okay, we're gonna be overworked as hell, so we, I'm gonna need to hire someone after this probably. But it's okay. The hype the hype should get us some money hopefully, and it should be pretty good overall. Okay, so not long until okay, and you need a break too. So it's one one week. 
We're almost done, so this is perfect timing. Nice. We'll draw my yellow cord. Oh, draw my yellow. Alright, let's let's see. Oh. Oh. Ooh, not bad for our first turnout. Hype is pretty high now. Didn't make it in top 100 boosts, unfortunately. That's okay. Let's finish. 49 hype. These aren't the best ratios. We've reached 30, 15 before. We leveled up a lot of shit, though, so that's good. Salary. Oh, finally. There we go. And we got a bunch of research points we can spend. You go on vacation. Meanwhile, okay, play system. That's fine. Let's do... Um... Uh, it's Phil Pizzi Oh, well, new reviews are in. Oh boy, this doesn't look good. Ah. See, you can do everything right and still have it full short. And it's just not your fault. You just have to put up with it. I've gotten really unlucky these past few games. <sighs> Nothing I can do about that. Get someone who's better at tech. Sequel, finally, Jesus Christ. Okay, we, we could really use some sequel ability. Um, I'm a little more balanced. This should be all right. Hire them. What's your name? J uh, Jonathan Tate? Okay. You need some welcome training. Okay, well, we... I mean, we... The game meets the required ratings. Okay, so that's good. Play systems out. You did you go on vacation? It doesn't look like you went on vacation. So you're not even at full capacity. What is this shit? Sound is important for it. Okay, that's that's where I went wrong, I guess. Because usually sound doesn't matter. Unless I was just reading the wrong thing, maybe. I don't know. Contract work. What's this? Updated our client list. Me oh, medium contracts. Okay. Um, why are these? Why is everyone like not quite at full capacity? Mm, okay, whatever. Oh, okay. Now we're now we're good. Research sequels. Absolutely. Uh, you research some good shit like dialogue trees might be useful. Let's get some better AI. That sounds good. You can do some training, except we don't have enough research points. Whoops. I'm one too few. I'm one short. Okay. Did I generate game report? Yeah. Well, we got sequels. Let's do a little bit of contract work. Something simple like this. <coughs> Okay. Okay, now you do some training. Um, that's speed and stuff. Let's see what this one does because I don't remember. Okay, it looks like it's mostly design. That's all right. You'll become better balanced that way. No, I don't want your fucking corporate espionage. Okay. Not bad. Can we uh can we do a save? Okay, save. Let's develop a sequel. Now, what should it be to? What's uh this is a good game we made, Collector. That's the best game we've ever made, in fact. But I'm thinking one of my older properties, maybe um Final W perhaps. Let's go for that. Racing sim for the PC. Uh, it will use juice sip. Everyone's fine. Small. We don't have enough fans for medium. And this will be final W. Um, uh, wind is on my yeah. wind is on my face after the line from speedy speed boy <laughs> final w wind is on my face okay 
Right. What do I want? Sim. That's okay. And then maybe this can be our game for G3. I'm not sure. Looks like we're going a little too fast for that, unless I delay it a bit or something. AI is important. Level design is quite important for racing. Let's do that. Now we'll, we'll make something else for G3. We'll make a sequel to something else, maybe Mouse Souls or something. Let's do some marketing. Let's do magazines. Okay. We've got pretty good hype anyway. Uh, that doesn't matter. Sound. Sounds pretty useful for racing, especially because it's a Eurobeat game. Eurobeat based game. Ooh, getting a lot of points on these. Ooh, oh, we're done, okay. Just need to wait for the bugs to be fixed. Okay. Hey, new tech record, not bad. Level up, level up, cool. Multiple, ah, nice, nice, nice. Not sure what I'll go for next. Probably the sound, just because we have pretty shit. So. It is a motherfucking initial D reference. I named the first game Final W, so um, it's, it's, you know, it, W, it, the final is the opposite of initial, and W is the fourth to last letter of the alphabet. Oh no! What the fuck? What is this shit? Okay, well seven. Can we can we get like an eight? 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 No, a seven? Okay, eight please? Eight? Eight? Come on, eight? 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 eight. Ugh. Fine. I'll have to do you do a game report you do some research no nope. we need 40 rp for stereo sound 40 for two for 3d graphics v2 kind of sucks those meh let's just try to pump out some games get more research points praise that i had a newer engine at least which yeah um Okay, that's fine. Okay, let's just make more games until we got um, enough research points for important stuff. Probably gonna go for, for the sound first, as I said. Let's develop another sequel. This time to Mouse Souls, I'm gonna say. Where is it? Mouse Souls. It's a medieval action game for the PC. And we're gonna go Juice Sip. And. Everyone is fine. Uh, and it will be Mouse Souls 2. That's fine. Can't be bothered to think of a subtitle. Benegay will be off market soon. That's fine. Okay, we definitely know the gameplay is useful. Uh, okay. This will be what we show off at G3. Curtin Gillen from Gamers. Oh, yes, please. Uh, let's be modest, because we're not big enough to... I, I don't think I ever chose the hype up game option before. Okay. Do, 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 do. Level editor, why not? Marketing, let's go. Magazines. <coughs> and it's going to be a G3, so this should be the biggest hype that we've ever gotten. We got an interview, we got marketing, and we're gonna have G3. So that'll be very, very useful. Time this basically perfectly, I think. We're reaching a new peak of technology. Okay, here's G3. Game's basically ready. <coughs> and we'll drop it straight after, assuming that we don't get any bugs. Okay, let's one. How many did we get? Not bad, not bad. Hype is 85. Yep. Didn't make it to the top 100 booths. Final W is off the market. And let's finish. Ben again, no longer supported. Let's go. 85 hype. New peak for technology and pretty good design too. Let's release the game. Please don't do well. Come on. Ooh. Okay. Okay, this is good. I'm enjoying this. Nice. Hey, 8.75. Not fucking bad at all. 
Okay, generate a game report so we can get some sweet research off of that. And it's selling well. I'm glad. Can we get back up to 2 million though, please? That'd be useful, thank you. Mm-hmm. You're starting to get tired. I want to wait to send these guys both on vacation at the same time. Thank you. That was the person that interviewed us. Mouse Souls 2. Okay, sounds important. We'll keep that in mind for Mouse Souls 3. Okay, there we go. Both of you go on vacation. It's the right time of year for it. Around month 9 is when you should do it. So you can start preparing for G3 the next year. You want to kind of aim for 1 to 2 games each year. Maybe only 1 once you start making medium and large games. Maybe even 1 every couple of years in that case. Everyone you know knows that many games show up at uh, uh, subsequent e e E3s for, like, in a row. Um, what research can we do? We're not quite, we don't have quite have enough research to look at uh, stereo sound or 3D graphics, V3, but oh well. Um, let's develop a sequel to another old classic. What have we got? We've got, let's do an Anovando sequel. Why not? Anovando's, uh, I'll just base them on each like each of the campaigns. So we'll say Anovando's Call of the Phoenix. Fancy RPG, everyone. Um, PC. Actually, is fantasy good for mature? I think fantasy is like good for all three, like a triple plus kind of thing. Yeah, so I'll make that mature because I can now. Uh, Juice sip engine go. Start development. This won't be our G three game, but it's fine. Um, be a nice surprise for the kind of end of the year time. Maybe we can even get it in for the holiday season. I don't know if that's a if that's a thing in this game where holiday season will increase sales or anything, but it would make sense. Okay, let's do some marketing. Okay, got some decent hype. Reaching decent development there. Sound is enough. Should be alright. Hmm, doing well for design. Okay, let's fix some bugs. And I can just get this in for the holiday season, if that's even a thing. Yeah, month 11, week 3, that's like November 21st. It's like perfect holiday season time. Ranching story. No, I'll wait. Oh, how did it go? Okay, not bad. Not bad. Uh, and all right, I'm okay with that though. Let's do game report. Meanwhile, you can research fucking stereo sound, and then hopefully, and then after we do 3D graphics, V2, and maybe one other thing, strategy games. Okay, we'll make a strategy game for G3. That's fine. For G3, G3 is in six months. Depends on how quickly I can make this stuff. Are you guys gonna be tired soon? I hope not. No, because you just you just had your vacation before you made this game. Okay. Graphics important. Okay. Let's see. Um, strategy, strategy, strategy. Do I have any old uh, strategy franchises that were good? I think Collector Cosmos was a strategy, right? No, it was simu simulation. Um, is this like a zombie strategy? Zombie action. Damn it. City strategy. Let's make a sequel to Gothic Revival. Um, Gothic Revival. Gothic Re-Revival. <laughs> PC. City game. Yeah, uh, everyone's fine. Juice it. Go. I'm playing this a little faster than I usually would just to try to make it entertaining for the stream. Uh, that's not a use. That's not important. Um, oh, maybe I forgot. Maybe it's because I forgot to put in linear story last time. I was think I was rushing a bit. Uh, what's uh? Are we doing strategy? Okay, strategy. Oh no! I actually want it like this. Okay. Got a little bit of hype. I don't know where that came from because I haven't started marketing yet. Um, OK. 
Okay, let's do some marketing. Oh no, it got a bug. No, <laughs> that's not going to bode well. Oh, no, uh, mid link. Yeah, I think fans do passively generate hype, but I didn't think, I, I'm not used to getting it this early. How long have I been going for? Over two hours. Not bad. Um, the game runs for like 36 years, so I think I'm gonna go until, well, I could I could go for either 12 or 18. Let's see. Um, game report, I guess. Get some research. Mm, and then we should do one more game for G3 and then we can start making an engine probably. Sequel, great responses. Really? Okay, if you say so. Okay, let's do a, a story quest, not important. Okay, save. Um, sequel, what can I do? Strategy is still popular. Any uh, any old strategy? Yeah, let's do a biblization sequel. Um, but, um, Just going for the most retarded titles. Um, is colonization good for like mature? I'm assuming, probably. Excuse me. Come on. No, everyone. Um, pick platform, PC. Do sip bibliotuation. See if I can't get that, that grab of the strategy hype. Again, you and I already did it. It doesn't abruptly end, but um, new events stop happening, like consoles won't release, stuff like that. So that's basically the end of the game. Uh, there's also like a speed setting you can change, so you can make it take less or more years. And that's basically a difficulty, because if it goes faster, then you have to react faster and make better games faster, so it's harder. But then if you give yourself more time, then it's easier, because, yeah. I'm playing on normal, which is 36 years, and it r r roughly follows real life because it starts in like the equivalent of 1984, I think. So, so it goes up to like 2020, is the idea? Because it, um, the last few consoles to be released are the Ninten Ninvento Swap, the Mbox Next, and the Play System Five. So. Not bad. Let's see how we do. And then uh, I'm going to do some research. You, oh, quite a few players use illegal copies. Let's just warn them. Um, generate game report. Okay, new reviews. Oh, that's good. Hey, a 10. <coughs> awesome. For the record, I've never gotten a perfect 10 in, in this game. I've only gotten 10, 10, 9, 10. So, like... Oh, hang on a minute. Are we going to get a perfect 10? Oh, no. This is what happened before. <laughs> this is the highest I've ever gotten is 9.75. Still, though, it's fucking great, and we had the hype for it, so this should do us very nicely. And then we can research 3D graphics, and then make a new engine and shit. It'll be good. All right, come on. One more research point. Ah, oh, nice. Okay. We've got a good amount of them. We can research 3D graphics V2. 
We sent some warnings. Piracy is an increasing problem. Some say you should. Some companies invest a lot of money and effort. Yeah, an inventor as well. They all have silly names like that. Uh, some companies invest a lot of money and effort. Others think it's better to take a more relaxed approach. We gained some fans. Okay. Well, yeah. Okay. Did well. Cool. Research this. Then we're gonna make a. Ooh. Okay. We got a good review there. Sometimes again, we'll just give you some nice reviews. Market is normalized again. Well, we just managed to capitalize on the end there, and we're doing well for ourselves because we jumped up to 2.7 million. Okay, new engine time. That'll give us a bunch of research points for in, for another engine too. Uh, character progression and better AI. Okay, so we we've added a few things. So we want uh, whoops. What we want we want um, what's after juice sip? It's soda sip. Oh, these guys are starting to get tired. Okay, we'll send you guys on vacation as soon as we're done with this. Then we'll start make, preparing to make a game for G3. So, I don't know how long I'll go because mm, we're already at two hours and seven minutes and we're only at year 10. So I feel like this would, this would take us to like three and a half hours. I mean, that's another length for a stream. I don't know if I want to go that far though. I might do this in three streams. I might just go to like year 12. We'll see. You two go on vacation. Excuse me. You two go on vacation right now. That said, you haven't been here for long, Ben, so maybe I should show you more of the game. I don't know. We'll see. Is there anything I can research other than a new topic? Yeah. Multiplayer. Let's do that. It's useful. I'm not sure if that's something you have to incorporate in the engine or if you can just put that in games. There's some features that you don't actually have to have part of like the engine proper. I'm not sure about multiplayer. I know stuff like the graphics and sound. Okay, let's see. Year 11, month one. Okay, so we're at the start of the new month. Super TS, no longer supported. So we're kind of in the Nintendo 64 era. Kind of 1995, 1996-ish here. Um, let's see. Let's develop a sequel with our new engine uh, and it will be a new racing sim now is there is there a current console that's good with sims that isn't PC TS64 is dead Dreamvast I'm not going to buy a license for because we all know that that fails uh, not really until the new or the PS3 so um, racing sim can just be on PC again and this will be final W uh, we can name this one after something from the top Okay, uh, how's it go? It's like, this is about as far as you've ever gotten? Okay. Well, if you tune into my next stream, whenever that is, then, um, we'll go further. Yeah, I know that's a great comment. Okay, uh, how does the chorus of the top go? It's the final level on top of the world, and I will never rest one second again. One more time, I have beaten the map, the sound gaps, and the moon is the end. They all say I'm right, but to give it up, what a fool to believe in my eyes. Now they fall in line with the top, are you ready now to die? I think this music is distracting me, give me a second. I don't know, and just like. Final W, the top, whatever, it's fine. <laughs> um, PC. And we use Soda Sip. Let's go, bitches. <coughs> Character progression, why not? Um, let's not spend money on a linear story. Oh, we got a little bit of hype. I guess that's from our fans. Hey, Polaris. Aw. That's a shame. But I mean, you've seen me play the... Oh, you haven't seen, but you've kind of been on call. You've all been playing this game before anyway, so it's fine. Uh, let's be modest. I think modest is like um, lower risk, lower reward kind of thing. So 
if you if you hype it up and then the game sucks, then it'll like really bite you in the ass. But if you hype it up and it's really good, then it's it will really help you. So I think that's just how hype works in general, anyway. So maybe I should kind of be a bit less modest sometimes. Whatever. Um, sounds quite important. Stereo sound. Yeah, yeah. Uh, we don't need an open world. It's a racing game. Oh, let's do some marketing. Mm. Right, magazines are fine. We've got pretty good hype, considering we haven't gone to G3 with this game. Uh, we're going to have to make something else for G3 very quickly. Present something in its early stages, perhaps. This is a decent split. Leveled up gameplay. And uh, Jonathan Tate leveled up, so we have to pay him some more. That's all right, though. No longer have mediocre Wi-Fi as a crutch. Yeah, you did. You did listen in. Okay, how does this go? Oh no, this is bad. Uh, I think Final W might be a dead franchise. Might be a dead. Oh, we got a six. Okay, it's just kind of it's just kind of mediocre. I think I'll I think I'll get leave it leave it to rest for a uh, for a decade or so. <laughs> Wait until people get nostalgic for it, despite it being mediocre. I don't know if that actually works. Whatever. Um. Games with new topics. Okay, well, we can do that. You research a new topic. What's next? Hacking? Yeah, you know what? Let's make a hacking-based game. Uh, what's hacking good with? I guess it's not listed here. Sim and strategy and mature. So maybe for something for PC like that. So let's make... Uh, um, I wanted to make a sequel for G3, but I guess I'm going to make something with a new topic, just to capitalize on that trend. Hacking, uh, similar strategy. It'll be my version of F-Zero. But F-Zero is actually good, though, according to the people that like it. Um, similar strategy for my hacking game. I'll decide that in a minute. So to sip. PC. Mature. Yeah. So similar strategy. It doesn't really matter. So I think I've made more sims. So I'll go strategy. I don't know what people have said. Let's hope they said strategy. Um, oh, what do I call a game about hacking? Um, Stonewall Jackson is like a historic figure, right? I don't know who he is, but the name is in my head, and I'm thinking of making a pun with Firewall Jackson. <laughs> okay, this is too good not to fucking do fucking Firewall Jackson. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Small booth is fine. Oh no, we dipped below 2 million again. Um, right, what am I doing? It's a strategy, so... Uh, something like that. Okay. Um. Oh, okay. Um, something like that's fine. Let's do some marketing, bitch. <coughs> Let's hope this does well. I'm not really sure what to do for this one. It's assu it's assuming low for that, and it's assuming pretty good for this, so let's do that. See how that goes. And G3 is coming up in 3, 2, 1. I don't really have time for this. Come on. Show me how many people I got. Okay. Mm, not in the top 100 booths yet. It's okay. This is only the fourth year of G3. Got 60 hype. Not bad. Let's just fix, fix these bugs and head off. Not head off. Uh, release it. 30, 36 design. I think that's a record. Oh, the record's for both. Okay. This should be quite good then. Hopefully. Easter eggs. Uh, renovations. Not yet. That's something I want to wait until... Because I haven't really increased it in cash since I got here. Like, I came here with about... 2 million cash, and I haven't really gone up. 
Oh no, this is mixed. Uh, oh, seven? Mm, I think it's leaning further down. No? Okay, okay. That really worried me there. It looked like I was going to get some mixed scores. But we got a 7, 8, and 8, and here's the wild card. Okay. I think they've become kind of less of a wild card recently. Okay. Uh, oh, the Dream Vast. Yeah, it's going to do so well. Okay. Um, we're doing pretty well on research points. Let's get generate a game report to get some more. Is there anything that I want to research badly? Dialogue tree, not really. Day Night Cycle would be useful. I uh, haven't really done anything with dialogues, to be honest. That's because I haven't been doing a lot of games that really require it, like adventures and, and RPGs that I've been doing like previous time. Um, simple cutscenes might be useful for story and quests, but again, nothing's really needed that. Day and night cycle is probably quite useful. After that, I think I'm going to save up, though. Okay, how's Firewall Jackson doing? Uh, not bad. It's getting us up there. We're going to breach 2 million again? Okay, we've kind of breached 2 million. Um, we are slowly making a bit more money, but we've we've kind of stagnated in the past, like, 3, 4 years, and I'm, I'm not, not happy about it. Okay, let's see what I can do. Um, let's make a sequel to... Gothic re-revival. See if I can do something with that. And then I want to save Anavandos, the Anavando sequel for like the next G3. This is the same random number machine that I see and use this. <laughs> oh, sick burns from Polaris. Okay. Um, yeah. I can't call this one Gothic re-re-revival because that's just stupid. Um... Gothic Neo Revival, why not? City, hang on, let me, let me see if it would be, because it's on PC, it's a strategy. Let's see, is, um, is City good for mature audiences? No, not really, it's good for everyone. Okay, let's just do that. Okay. Mm, after this, I might send them on vacation too. Uh, what have we got? gonna be a strategy so we want yeah something like that oh huh, got a bit of hype not sure what that's from but fair enough uh, let's do some marketing Why do I hate the archivists of the f Oh. <laughs> uh, I don't. I'm just being stupid. Okay, this is my holiday game. Market's normalized again. That's fine. I was making a sequel anyway. Hype 24, not bad. Oh, new record for technology. That's good. I leveled up. Special training available for autumn. Oh, yeah. Let's generate a game report. First reviews. Let's see. Oh, pretty high. Oh. They faked me out there. Are we leaning high sevens? Yep. Okay. I'm happy with this. We've kind of we've made the the gothic series better. And what are you gonna give me? Go on ten. Uh, all right. Well, whatever. They like it as a game anyway. Seven point five is not bad. I've I've gone a lot less like kind of nine plus games recently. I've only really gone like one or two. Whereas uh, by this point, I'd gotten like five or six in uh, my first playthrough. I saw it out better in this one, but I kind of, by this point, I was better in the other one. Probably because I'm rushing. No, I'm not going to renovate the office yet. I don't really have enough money for that. Okay, can I, what what publishing deals are there? Is there anything, okay, Gameling, I've already got a license for that. Um, casual is good for Gameling, I think. Yeah, Yongo says any topic. Okay, what what's good with casual then? That I have zombies apparently. I don't know why, but zombies are good. I can make a silly. I, I th again, I think that's because of plants versus zombies. So I could make something like that. Um, vocabulary is good. I think that's good at um casual and young audiences. Um, racing. 
I could make a racing game for Gameling. That would work out pretty well. So let's let's do that. Let's make a racing game uh, for the Gameling. Yep, yeah, that's what I meant. Soda Sip. Um, ignore the fact that I'm using fucking 3D graphics for the Game Boy. Totally makes sense. Um, and what am I going to call it? I could I could uh, have it be a pun on F0. I could do the whole like reverse letter of the alphabet thing. So F is the sixth, so U, V, W, X, Y, Z. So it'd be like U, infinity. Maybe like infinite U. Infinite racing U, I'll call it that. <laughs> Sure. Yeah, 3D graphics on the game link. <coughs> I wonder if this will take long enough to be shown at G3. Probably not. Uh, and yeah, we actually this is the first time we're making a, me a medium game with the right amount of stuff for it for once. So, you're a tech person. So wait, wait a minute. What do we want for this? It's giving me no hints. So, what's casual supposed to be? Oh, casual. Casual's like this. Okay. Um. I will. I will take this, you can do that, you can do that, not a lot, but, uh oh, they're starting to get tired, that's not good, I believe we want something like that, yep, you've got pretty good design, so you can go there, I'll take that, you can take that. Yep. Oh, uh, can't forget marketing. Magazines are fine. Until I get more money, like more consistent kind of growth, I'll wait out for that. Graphic. What was that? Is not important. Sounds quite important there. Um, that's a tech thing. You can do that. You can do that. And I will take what well, design. He'll only be a little bit overworked. And this should this should do pretty well, I think. Got some decent hype. Um, See, so yeah, I'll go to I'll go to the end of this year, and then I think I'm gonna stop unless I feel like continuing. Okay, not bad, not bad for the scores here. Record with design. It's a pretty well designed racer. Uh, increase in salary, yeah, yeah. Rich backstory, okay. Vacation, vacation, uh, game report, please. Okay. Six seems to be the fucking consistent number of this. And then it does a four just to spite me. There's the fucking wild card in play. God damn. Well, we've got a lot of research points at least. So. That'll, that'll be useful. Um, juice sip. That was my previous one. Um. Yeah, let's let's give it away. That'll be good, be good for our fan for getting fans and stuff. Old engine, recent decision, positive response. We've got one k fans. Only cost us four point three k. That's fine. Um, did we do well enough? I think we did. I think I'd skip past that message. Ven Oasis will be off the market soon. All right. Uh, let me do a save because. Um, it's not really a good time to research. We should we should make a game now, and then we'll have loads of research points so we can spend on whatever we want. So let's develop a sequel, and this will be to Anavandos, Cult of the Phoenix. And we will call this one uh, Anavandos, Memories of Winter's Past. See what I'm doing here? Not that it's, like, you know, clever in any way. Uh, PC, so to sit. Okay. Small booth. How much is a medium booth? I could probably afford that. Let's do a medium booth. 
just this once. Just just to just to put something fancy near the end of this. Okay, uh story and quests. What do I is that what I want? RPG? Yeah, story and quests, pretty good gameplay, so I really need to progress on my story stuff, but I mean whatever. Um Okay. Oh no, it's too long. I'm gonna have to fix that before I I'm done. Um, something like this. Yeah. Multiplayer sequel called World of What? I mean, I could. I could do that. It could be like an MMO. There is the option to make MMOs. That might be an, an interesting path to try to take next time. But I don't think I'm growing fast enough to get the right kind of money and stuff to make that. It's quite difficult. Maybe if I play on easy, but that would take way longer to stream. Um, marketing, we want, yeah, let's, let's go big on this one. Let's fucking splash out on 150k there. Um, sound not important. Mm. Oh, it's time to take my estrogen. You should be kept out of the battle against the very hungry catfish. What are you talking about? <laughs> oh, is this in, um, Etrian Odyssey? What the hell is my estrogen? I cannot find it. This is worrying. Oh, there it is. Um, let's see. Mirabel was MVP. Gregory nearly got. Oh, and Gregory not got knocked out. Leeson got. Vord. Um, Siliqui finished it off. So, those four should definitely be him. The Tonus, no. So, no, it's, it's between Tarja and, um, is today Monday? It is. Uh, it's between Tarja and Einkill. Um, well, Ankel was useful in healing Grigory, so... Well, okay. I don't know. Up to you, then. It's be probably between Tarja and Ankel. You can decide that. Grigory being revived didn't really add much to the battle anyway, so... Could be either. people can oh we're showing off infinity racing you really not anavando's memories of winter's past that's annoying i guess it wasn't off the market yet god damn okay we got really hard design for this one so uh, venoes is not support that's fine okay edit this name while we still can memories of i'm just going to remove the apostrophe we'll have a slightly different title No, I'm not fucking investing in that yet. First, really? I fixed the name. Whatever. Hey, we got a really high score. This will be a good note to end on. Almost perfect. Almost, the, the only reason it's not perfect is because the fucking name didn't get fixed somehow. Even though I clearly fixed it. You guys all saw me do it. Okay, game report, and then we can do a shit ton of research, and then I will um, end the stream, probably. Yeah, two and a half hours, that's okay for a stream length. Okay, you research. Um, Easter eggs aren't really useful. We probably, need, we probably need to do these two, like branching story and dialogue tree and stuff. Well, branching story... 
you research um was research oh i wasn't it, it didn't think i was clicking on him um better dialogues in general because that's just a it, it stacks with other stuff oh that's fun okay um simple cutscenes is probably useful I can do both dialogue trees and rich backstory. And I'm not that far off from being able to do it with simple cutscenes too. But I kind of want to save some. So dialogue tree will have to wait because I've got better dialogues anyway. Rich backstory will be useful. Another memorable game. Whoever wrote the story would likely win a prize for it. I don't even remember infant racing use off the market. Well, I made a decent amount of money. So request important. Okay, completed, completed. Ooh, multi-genre. I might actually look into that. That'd be fun. Oh, hey, we breached 3.1 million. That's really useful. Um, okay, you can research multi-genre then. Never mind, that's ATRP. Um, we don't have 3D graphics v3 yet. I kind of want to save up for that because I know that's going to be costly. So I'm going to leave this for now. And... We can't make a new engine yet. Um, do a little bit of contract work um, just until these guys get tired because I need... Let's see. That's a bit much. Ah, whatever, let's just do some easy ones. I don't feel confident enough to do the other... The, like, ones with the fucking 40s there. Let's see. Made a lot of money off of that. That's good. Okay, got some good research points. Let's do some more. Let's be round out at the end of the year. Hi, George. Has he already got a fucking Halloween name? Is that what that is? Okay, we didn't get a whole lot of research points from that. It's just a shame. Probably gonna need to make a game. I said I would leave it here. We are at the end of year 12. Yeah, I think I think this is a fine place to end. I think it, a better place might be to to do uh, to make a new engine, but that could take a little while because I do want to wait until we unlock the ability to do 3D graphics version three before I can do that. So we made three engines. It's fine. Let's just save and I'm gonna leave things off there for today. So thanks for coming along, guys. Um, sorry if you missed some of the stream, but I will be uploading this as a vod anyway. So that should be fine. And um, see you guys then. Maybe I'll chat with you in voice chat or whatever in a minute. Bye.